Hello all, welcome to Binary Programming. In this video, we will solve the second challenge of SOQL for admins module. The name of the challenge is create SOQL queries in Apex classes. Let's move to the challenge. So in this challenge, we need to create a for loop to iterate through a SOQL query. So we need to write a query to get the name and the annual revenue of all the accounts. And then using a for loop, we need to iterate through each account and print the name and the annual revenue of each account to the debug log. So the information related to class, method and the list and the query is already given to us. Let's move to the org and complete this challenge. So in the org, we are going to the developer console. And in the developer console, we are going to create a new Apache class. The name of the Apache class is given to us. Let's copy the name from here. This is account utility. So this will create a new Apache class for us. Now we need to create a method for this. So the name of the method is also given to us that is view annual revenue and it should be public static and void. So let's create a method here. So public static void and the method name that is view annual revenue. Now inside this method we need to create a list called account list and we need to query and assign the account name and the annual revenue from the account to this list. So let's create a list. So list of account. The name of the list is also given to us. That is accounts list. We'll paste it here. And in this list, we are going to assign the name and, and annual revenue from account. So this is it. Now we have created a list and assigned the name annual revenue from the account. Now the next step is to we need to create a loop that iterates through the result which is getting assigned to this account list. And finally we need to print the account name and the annual revenue in the format of account name colon annual revenue into the debug log using the variable name account rev. So let's create a new variable of string type called account rev and now we will write a for loop to iterate the list so account let's say acc colon the accounts list and here what we are going to do is inside this string variable which we have created we are going to assign the name acc dot name colon acc dot annual revenue this is it so this is a format which is given to us in the challenge that is account name colon annual revenue now the last step which we need to do is print this account rev variable to the debug log so Inside this for loop, we are going to write system dot debug, and in this, we are going to print the account rev variable. So this is it. So we have created a class called account utility. Inside that class, we have created a public static void method called view annual revenue. Later on, we have created a list of account, and we are fetching the account details like name and annual revenue from the account object and assigning it into this accounts list. We have created a string variable and after that we have just iterated this account list and in the format called account.name colon account.annual revenue we are assigning it to variable and finally we are printing it into the debug logs. So this is the complete set of instructions which is given to us in this challenge and we have completed it. Let's check whether we have done it correct or not. So yes, we have completed this challenge and got 500 points for this. See you guys in the next video with a new challenge. Thank you.